Hello, beautiful people. My name is Aster T, and here we are back on the Bullcraft server, season two, episode three. I've been working on the mansion thingy majigger a lot, and this is what we have so far. So I got, I added in the clock in the middle, built it up higher. I repeated the second and third floorish patterns as kind of the same-ish. Added that triangle roof and um, and the, um, the main roof over the what is to be the lobby-ish area. I really like the shape of this one. Um, let's get into a nice F1 mode and view it in all of its glory. So I've been talking about texture packs recently. I wanted to try out two texture packs, so let's try them out right now. And bam! Here we have the paper cutout texture pack. This is a really cool texture pack that I used, um, I think I used this before in one of my old I think on the Muddy Puddles series that I had to discontinue because um, I don't think the server was getting updated too much. Um, parts I like about this, I like the stone, or not the stone brick, the sand sandstone, it looks very bricky. Another part is the color of the cyan wool, it looks very good, but there are more negatives than positives in this one. The textures of the stone brick and cobblestone are too similar from far away. They don't really make a good difference in texture. Um, the texture of the cyan wool, it looks too clothy, like, like really stitchy and stuff. Don't like that. And the glass texture is not connected. Well, I think none of the textures are connected for glass in the other packs, but there are harsh outlines in this one. I do not like that. So let's check out the next one. And bam, we have the Max Max Pack Legacy, I think. Yes, I think. Yeah. This is a fan continuation of the popular Max Craft Max Pack texture pack. The original artist was not um, updating it anymore and gave permission to someone else to continue it. This is a very lovely texture pack. I like this one. The so, with what I like, I like the textures of the sandstone, cobblestone, and stone brick together. The colors are very, very good. The textures are distinguishable between one another. And I like the texture of the cyan wool. The thing I don't like about this is the color of the cyan wool. It is a very neon-y color. That's the only thing. But I really like this more than the paper craft for this build, as of right now. Um, the the person who updated it did a very good job. The andesite and the granite and whatever. Very easy to see, distinguishable. I won't have a um, hard time dis 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 Don't know my words. I won't have a hard time distinguishing some of them between gravel and cobblestone. So that's great. Back to the original. Alright, we are back. I just wanted to give you another view of this roof because I am so happy with the way it turned out. This is the underside of it. Um, it's from down here. Let's go back up. Run, fool! I've been using my double, double forward tap more for sprinting now than the control just because hitting control is kind of difficult from this position. Hitting shift is easy with my pinky but not control up, up 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 there needs to be a faster way to move up been thinking about slime box slime blocks i am having a very hard time with my words today so this is what the roof looks like from the side up angle-ish that middle area right here is going to be a room-ish place where you can have a view of the ocean and so that's what I have so far. I think this is the only roof that's going to be this shape. The other roofs will be traditional triangle-y shapes or like a cone shape, I think. Don't know if we're going to add like actual circular towers to this. But we'll see. This is like a make, up, make stuff up as you go kind of thing. <laughs> um, I, I really want to stream building this because I feel like recording recording the building stuff would will, will take like forever to upload so I think streaming is the best option but I do not know if my computer can handle streaming Minecraft 
decently just yet. Like, I'd probably have to play windowed to get this to work <laughs> decently enough. Need feather falling boots. I'm still on level 1 enchant iron armor. I have enchanted a lot of, um, not a lot, but like a few, a handful of diamond tools. Thanks to the new enchanting system, it's a lot easier to enchant the high level stuff while you're just starting off in a new, a new world. Come on! Sleep. There we go. I have a lot of things spawning in my, my mansion thingy because I don't use a lot of torches to light it up. So that's a flaw. But I don't want to have to take off all the torches later on when I'm finished building this. So yeah. Um, I think that's what I am. That's all I have for today to show you. Uh, since I can't do actual building since that would take forever because my process is kind of stupid. <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye!